Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Cora. If you are new here, thank you for dropping in. And if you're a seasoned subscriber, thank you for subscribing. Today I'm gonna to be doing an overview of one of my favorite crossbodies that I love to use when I travel. And this one is the Samore Floor Perforated Monogram. So let's get right into it. The Samore Floor Perforated Monogram came out in 2012 in Louis Vuitton's Cruise Collection and it was in collaboration with Sofia Coppola. If you look close at it, you'll see the diamond shape perforation and it's all along the bag, except of course the sides. It looks like two separate satchels connected to each other with a buckle and it has two separate openings, two buckles, one buckle here and another buckle on the other side. It has turquoise colored glazing and it already has a honey patina coloring to it so I don't have to worry about the vachetta getting dark. This measures at almost 12 inches in length, 9 inches in height, and about 6 inches in width. It has the gold colored hardware and this one I use mostly as a crossbody. Obviously you can use it also as a shoulder carry. And it has about nine holes with an adjustable shoulder strap. This is adjustable, however the shoulder strap isn't detachable. It's attached to the crossbody bag itself. The minimum drop that I measured for this is about 18 inches and the maximum drop is about 25 inches. Looking inside the bag, you'll notice it's a turquoise colored interior, kind of a micro suede lining. And this one here has a flap pocket to it, which runs all along the bag. This, however, doesn't have a very wide opening, so it's pretty narrow to try to get in. However, the base of it's wide. On the other side of the bag, also has the turquoise colored interior, but does not have a flat pocket. And it has the same issue as the other side where it's kind of hard to open it wide, but also still has a large base. Now we're gonna see what fits in this bag. Here in the front has the flat pocket. I'm gonna go ahead and put my iPhone 8 Plus in there. And then I have a Jujube small set piece that has all my little things in. I'm gonna go ahead and put that in here. And then I opted to do a smaller wallet for this bag. If you're interested in a video on the zippy coin purse. I'll go ahead and put that video at the end of the of this video. And this one fits in nicely. And then I know it's hard to see just because this bag has a small opening, but you still have some room on top as well. On the other side, it's a separate compartment or a separate satchel. I was actually able to fit my iPad in here. It's a little snug, but it fits nicely. And you still have about half an inch on top. And also if you wanna put a notebook in there, I have a notebook in here. And then I can go ahead and slide that in. 
and it closes and it fits. So this bag is one that is my favorite bag to bring with me when I travel. It's gone to Italy with me to Ireland. It's just such a durable bag. I haven't looking at it. There are no scuffs wear or tear really to it. It looks pretty new and fresh. And I, it's a beautiful color. I love the color of this. Love the honey patina color. Um, especially since I don't really care for such a light color vachetta. I'm always so worried of getting it dirty. This one here, I don't have to worry about it getting that dirty because it seems pretty durable and it hasn't darkened over the past eight years that I've had it. Especially with, especially since I travel with it. It fits a good amount in here, except just the only issue I have is just the opening is so small. It's kind of hard to slide things in there. Well, thank you for watching my video on the quick overview and review on the Samora Floor Perforated Monogram. Hope you guys take care and have a great day. Bye.